Hello and welcome. You're listening to Alistair Christie, and in this movie we're going to have a look at the owner versus parent question. If you don't have Delphi, you need it. Download the free Explorer edition from TurboExplorer.com. Let's create our new VCL Forms application and put some controls on. We'll start with a a button, a edit box. A, a panel and we'll check a, another button in the inside the panel. On the button I'm going to write in on click event. First I'm going to de declare a variable and to that variable I am going to assign sender as T control. So I'm I am casting the sender as a T control. And I pretty much know that it's always going to be one. Uh, con dot. So just testing if its parent is not nil. Uh, and if it's not, so show message, my parent is. The controls parent, and we want to know its name. Else, I have no parent. And we want to do basically the same thing for the owner property. Okay, I'm going to make this give us a bit of name. I'm going to call it Control Click. Now, for each of, these other, each of these other controls. Assign control click and on the form we'll assign control click as well. Let's now run that. And on button one, my parent is form one, my owner is form one. For the edit, my parent is form one, my owner is form one. For the panel, my parent is form one, my owner is form one. So there's a bit of a trend here. And for the button, my parent is panel one, so the button is a on the panel, so its parent is panel 1, but my owner is form 1. So while the button is on the panel, it's still owned by the form, and in fact everything you put on the form is going to be owned by the form. But here's the exception. If I, if I create a new other uh, Delphi Files frame, and let's just check our button on that and make this a bit smaller and go back to here and put a frame on here I'll put frame 2 on and on I'll select both the button and frame and assign control click to the on click event Let's run it again and click on the frame 21 and we get my parent is form 1, my owner is form 1, so no surprises yet. Click on button 1, my parent is frame 21 and my owner is fr frame 21. So the button is owned by the frame and the frame is owned by the form. And if we look at the structure view here we can see button 2, its parent is panel 1 and panel 1's parent is form 1. And likewise, button 1, button 1's parent is form 1, and so on. So if I just double click on the form, and we'll go into the constructor. Now, uh, button 2 is on the panel, but it's directly referenced through the form. Uh, that's because the uh, its owner is the form. But if we look at button 1 on the frame, we have to go through frame21.button1, 
because this button one is owned owned by frame 21. Okay, back to the form. What I haven't done yet is clicked on the form. So let's run this again and click on the form and we get I have no parent, so that's not necessarily surprising. And my owner is oh, blank. Okay, well, um, we'll have to do a little bit more digging for that. So let's go to the on click event on the form and create a new one. And my is of type form one dot owner dot class name. Okay, so let's run that. So we can't determine uh, who the owner is, so we can work out what the owner is. And if I click on it, my owner is of type T application. And uh, if we view the project source, we'll see that we have this application variable, which is of type uh, T application, and it creates form one. And that's pretty much all I wanted to show you today, so let's move on to the summary. The parent of a component is the thing that contains it, often a form frame or some sort of panel, a tab sheet or group box or whatever. The owner of a control is almost always a form frame or data module, uh, usually the one that it resides on. The owner of a control is responsible for destroying that control. It is usually done as part of its destructor. Forms have no parent, but they are owned by the application object uh, as it created it, but not always as you can create forms by other methods, and controls for that matter as well, but we may look at that later. Thanks for watching, this is Alistair Christie, signing off until next time.